Beth and Rip, I think the reason why people, I mean, my, my, my theory is, is that, you know, they're not perfect, mm -hmm. you know, and they, they have their struggles, they have their issues, and I think, you know, a lot of the audience looks at that and they, you know, whether they are having those same issues or not, yeah. you know, probably not as intense, but I think that they're challenged in so many different ways, but they have each other, and what happens is when they're together, they open up, so they get to see, you know, the armor come off. I think that's why they've fallen in love, is it's just, it's just, it's just not that perfect, like, you know, bull kind of, you mm -hmm. know, relationship. It's, mm -hmm. it's real. Rip and Beth get married in true Rip and Beth fashion. It was my mother's ring. We didn't have much Beth. We were poor, but it's yours. And so am I. I now pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> <laughs> what was the significance of that moment and, and as an actor who's been with her for four seasons now and it being a slow burn for your character's relationship to, to finally tie the knot, what was that like? I mean, the way it went down it was pretty wild. Mm -hmm. um, you know, her storming in and her gold dress and her, her dad and Kevin and I looking at her and going, what in the hell is she up to now? And then coming out and that she has a priest that she's kidnapped. I mean, it was just yeah. wild. And even as an actor, you're sitting there going, she's trying to put all the things together and connect mm -hmm. all the dots, and you're like, this is crazy, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> and then Lloyd comes in, I go get him, and, yeah. it's, and there's that moment with us because, you know, I've been kicking his ass all year because yeah. he ain't listening. But, um, you know, it, it all comes together, and there's actually this beautiful moment there together. Mm -hmm. And I know you've seen it, but yeah. I haven't. But I did it, and I felt like it was, it is crazy and weird and a whirlwind kind of marriage mm -hmm. as you could put on a screen. Yes. I thought it was pretty, uh, pretty touching in the end. And now, Miss Dutton, repeat after me, I, Beth Dutton. Yes, I do. No, um, not yet. <laughs> I love their wedding and it's just so typical Beth that she's just not interested in how a wedding party or wedding dress or any, all she cares about is being his wife and, 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 and because she's, she knows that she's just about to ruin her life, mm. you know, the next day. So it's like, I'm gonna go out his wife. And there's something, I don't know, I kind of find her slightly heroic in a really yeah. messed up way. Thank you. Uh, thank you for doing this, Father. Oh, you're welcome. And uh, don't worry, I won't press charges. Charges? Sorry, Daddy. Yeah, I had to kidnap him. It's hilarious and poetic at the yeah. same time. It's just perfect. It's a perfect way. When I read that, I, it made me laugh because I knew, mm -hmm. I knew we were going to get married this season, but I didn't know how. And then he set it up that we're going to go find this beautiful spot to do it in. And, and of course, that doesn't ever happen. She's right. like, we're doing it now <laughs> here. I loved it. Like she's throwing the chairs out of the way and you just know, walk, strutting down the yeah. even aisle, just this grass. With that, with that crazy outfit from the prison. Uh, right. Yeah. Perfect way for a perfect couple. <laughs>